learned a lot of things over the years, and one of those things is that in many cases it takes much more courage to forgive oneself than it takes to continue to blame yourself for everything. We have all sinned. We've all fallen short of the glory of God. But in Jesus, if we trust him to be what he says he is, the forgiver of all, then we have forgiveness. We have redemption. And if you think about it, the Apostle Paul probably had a bigger struggle with this than most anybody else we can think of in the Bible. You remember before Paul became the great apostle of Christ, he had been the persecutor of the saints. He was the one who went out and hunted up Christian groups, and he drugged them to jails. And in some cases, he literally murdered these people. Yet he comes to Christ. And I've got to wonder, how many times do you suppose over the coming years, Paul would stand up in front of a crowd, and he would look out there, and he would catch the eye of a woman whom he had widowed, or maybe the eye of a child whom he had orphaned. Check out the new series on praiseandharmony.tv called Come to the Table by Dr. John Mark Hicks. The gospel invites all to the table. The gospel doesn't make a division between rich and poor, slave and free, male and female, black and white, Jew and Gentile. The gospel doesn't make those kind of divisions. The gospel unites at the table, and the table is the experience of communion between the rich and the poor, between the Jew and the Gentile, between the male and the female. In this eight-part study, you'll grow from in-depth lessons about communion. This series comes with PDF study guides and materials for small group leaders or families to use to help facilitate a more meaningful time of learning. I like the way Luther put it. When I am afflicted and a Satan is assaulting me, I don't run away from the table. I run to the table. Because this is a table of mercy. See, God is doing something at this table. I know we don't typically think about it that way. We tend to think about, what am I doing? I'm remembering, I'm proclaiming, I'm eating. But we need to think about what God is doing at this table. Come to the Table, available now at praiseandharmony.tv.